Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Zelda Ocarina of Time. Last episode we finally completed the third dungeon and in this episode we're going to do a lot of things or actually in, in the upcoming episodes we're going to do a lot of Skullchilla collecting and it really needs to be done. I'm sorry, uh, it is kind of boring and I'd agree but it really needs to be done. I want to do it right now and not later in the game. Um, because now I have the time to do it later in the game it will be even more annoying if um, if I'm going to collect Skullchilas so I hope you guys don't mind because it really really needs to be done and uh, I'm not a big fan of Skullchilla collecting myself but since I'm trying to complete this game a 100% there's not much I can do so I hope you'll still enjoy this episode um, so yeah I'm I know that it isn't very um, very fun to watch at all, me collecting Skulltulas, but I still hope you will enjoy it. So, um, first we're actually going to um, Hyrule Castle. We're first going to Princess Zelda, and after that we're going to do the Skulltula hunting. So, we're first going to do some cool stuff before we do the boring stuff. Hope you guys don't mind. So, yeah, there, I actually had to plan a whole route out, because... Um, there's a lot of Skulltulas we can collect since we have the boomerang and these Skulltulas are really spread out so I really had to make my own um, my own route on what the best way um, to get those Skulltulas were and I'm actually not even um, I'm actually going to do the mask side quest I'm actually going to do that after we've uh, we've done the Skulltulas because else it's it will be um, it will be chaos. It will be just plain chaos because it's so annoying to get all the Skulltulas plus the uh, masks. Uh, there would be a lot of cutting involved in the video. So I really um, am not a big fan of that. So yeah, cutting. Um, cutting isn't really all that bad. But the problem is you need to remember um, how many minutes you cut out. Because if you want to make a video of like 20 minutes, you need to keep remembering. Um, how long it took you to go to a certain area and the, uh, the part you cut out you need to remember how, how long it took so you know how long you can keep playing but uh, as you can see the Hyrule Castle is closed for whatever reason so that's weird I guess well let's see what's going on because hmm oh my god just look at the sky man it's storming why is it so dark and yeah do you remember this scene we actually saw this in the beginning of the game in our dream yeah we actually saw this in our dream so is it actually happening I'm afraid so hmm so let's see what's happening oh my god it's a horse Link, get out of the way! So who's on the horse? Oh my, it's Zelda and Impa. Why are they? Why are they running away? I don't get it. Well, I actually do get it, but yeah, <laughs> I need to keep it a surprise. So, why? Wow, what did she throw again? I don't know. And oh my God! This, my guys, is Ganondorf. Maybe I've said it before. Maybe the game has said it before. But if uh, the game didn't, this is him. This is the villain of the game. Ganondorf. Arr, I lost her. You, over there, little kid. You must have seen the white horse gallop past just now. Which way did it go? Answer me! Don't answer, Link. You're better than that. So, you think you can protect them from me? You've got guts, kid. Yeah, man, Link, draw your sword. Kick his ass. Heh. 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 Okay, <laughs> that was kind of weird. You want a piece of me? Very funny. I like your attitude. What? Wait. Wait, what are you doing? No! No, no! What are you doing? No! Oh my god! Why did you attack me, Ganondorf? You. Rude person, you! <laughs> Pathetic little fool! 
Do you really realize who you are dealing with? I am Ganondorf, and soon I will rule the world. And I have a very long and sharp nose. <laughs> well, that's actually one of the things I found very funny about this uh, Ganondorf in particular. Because he has a very long and sharp nose. It's so funny. <laughs> I think all Gerudos have that, actually. Did I say that before? Because he's actually a Gerudo. It's also a race in... Um, in Zelda and we will be meeting those later on we actually already met one Gandorf but we will be meeting uh, other Gerudos later on we have been to Gerudo Valley but we haven't really seen a Gerudo yet but we will in the future so don't worry let's get this thingy that's uh, the princess fruit oh what the hell you found the Ocarina of Time this is the royal family's hidden treasure which Zelda left behind it glows with a mystical light so yeah, this is pretty much the most important item of the game because the game is called after the Ocarina of Time, so yeah. Curly, can you hear me? It's me, Zelda! Yes, I can hear you, I guess. Curly, when you hold this Ocarina in your hand, I won't be around anymore. Oh my. I wanted to wait for you, but I couldn't delay any longer. So we were too late? At least I could leave you the ocarina and this melody. So we're actually learning a new song. And whatever you try to do, you can never, ever um, be fast enough. You will always be too late. Always. And it's really depressing if you think about it. Because whatever, how hard you try, you will never ever be in time so let's learn the new song and also non no pun intended with uh, being in time or on time <laughs> doo -doo -doo. you've learned the song of time this is also a fairly important song not f not really that important however in this game as it is in the sequel to this game, Majora's Mask, but it has its uses in this game. Now, Curly, play this melody in front of the altar, altar in the Temple of Time. You must protect the Triforce! And um, we're actually not going to do that at the moment, because there's really a crap ton we need to do before we actually open the Door of Time. So before we do that... Um, I've, sa I've said before that uh, um, that there were actually Skulltulas in Long Long Ranch that we couldn't get at the time. But now that we have the Boomerang, we can pretty much get all Skulltulas you can get as a child. Well, I'm actually lying. There's actually a couple of Skulltulas we can't get at the moment. But we will be later on. But we do... We are able to get a lot of Skulltulas right now, so that's why the upcoming episodes will be kind of boring, because I really need to collect a lot of Skulltulas. And let's make it dark, because most Skulltulas only appear in dark, so it's better that we make it dark. There's really a lot of places we need to go. We first need to go to Long Long Ranch, we need to go to the Graveyard, we need to go to Gerudo Valley, Lake Hylia, there's so much to do. And for me, it's all exciting, but for you guys, it can be quite boring, and I and I appre appreciate that. Uh, I mean, I can fully understand that. So, oh my god, don't do that, Link. So, the best way is to first shoot them down with the slingshot, because the boomerang isn't as accurate. So, let's first kill this one. Okay, and now wait till the thingy appears. Okay, now we can target it. So, that's another Skulltula for us. Really nice. And the other Skulltula in this area is actually all the way, all the way over there. Yeah. On the other side of the ranch. So, that's kind of annoying, I guess, because I think in later games, <coughs> in Skyward Sword, there are bugs that you need to collect. And those bugs can also be found on walls. And if, actually, if you roll into the wall, the bug will fall out. However, in this game, that isn't really the case, and you still need to use your boomerang. That would be really ni nice, however, if you just if you could just roll into a wall to uh, get the Skulltula. 
So let's see where the sculpture is because he could also be at another wall. So I need to be really quiet so I can hear the sculpture. Hmm. I don't think. Dude, go away. I don't think he's here, however. Um. It's kind of weird because it has to be somewhere. Okay, maybe it's on the other side. I'm really sorry about this, but, um. I don't quite remember this um, Skulltula all that well. I do know that you can get it at a w at a wall, but not particularly where. So I'm really sorry about that. Maybe it's right there. I'm not sure though. Let's check it out. Hmm. And rolling isn't really the fastest way to uh, to for transportation, but yeah, it doesn't matter. I usually roll I don't know why maybe here oh come on you know this is oh there it is oh, I finally got it sorry about the delay but um, not much I can do by about it I actually thought it was on the opposite side and go away you stupid keys oh wait they no that's actually not called a keys let's see what a thing is called oh never mind I don't know but um since we got all sculptures in um Long Long Ranch. I'll see you guys at the entrance of Kakariko Village because there's a another Skulltula we can get there. So I'll see you guys later. Okay, welcome back everyone. Right there is the entrance to Kakariko Village and the Skulltula you can get is actually all the way over there in that tree. Well, not really in that tree because as you can see there's not really much to it. But if you have the Rumble Pack and the Stone of Agony you can actually found find out that there's actually a hidden um, passage in here or a hidden hole so let's wait until it blows up and there it is oh it was on the other side well whatever it doesn't matter we still got it anyway it has quite a bit of um, um, how do you call it radius or something blast radius yeah there's quite a bit of blast radius so that's really useful and no don't attack me I actually want that sculpture that's over there so let's get that one and don't get hit by the other sculpture oh my god uh, let's try that again, shall we? Thank you. <clears throat> okay, let's get him. No, I want the other one. Uh, no, I want that one. Thank you! Okay, so that's nice. So let's now go outside. Um, I was actually talking about not being able to do the mask side quest yet. Um, while that is true, we can um, give the key to mask to the guards. Because... Um, we might as well do it now because if we do it later, um, that's um, that's more cutting, and we're actually on our way to the graveyard for our next sculptula. So yeah, we might as well go to the guard first and bring the Keaton mask before we go to gra to the graveyard, if you guys don't mind, of course. And it really saves me some cutting, so that's really nice for me, I guess. So I think we still have a little bit more time left. I'm really sorry that we didn't really do all that much in this episode, but it really has to be done. So I do, I do really appreciate it if you guys don't mind and just enjoy me playing this game. That's um, that I really appreciate. So let's give the Keaton mask to the guard, shall we? Okay, and let's see what he thinks about it. Do we? Yeah, we have the quiz. Wow! <laughs> Do you think you're in disguise, Mr. Hero? Oh. Is that a k something? Character mask? I I heard he is very popular recently. He's my boy's favorite. That key something mask. If you don't mind, will you sell it to me? Uh, of course, dude. Of course. My, bo my boy will be very happy with this. You really are Mr. Hero. Ha 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 ha. You sold the 10 rupee mask for 15 rupees. You earned a little profit. Let's go to the mask shop and pay back the mask price of 10 rupees. So yeah, that's actually all you have to do. You just have to um, to merge all those masks. And it is actually a kind of fun side quest, I must say. Um, however, I'm not going back to the mask shop at the moment because we're actually going to do the mask sh mask um, mask shop side quest after the Skullchlas, but yeah, I thought, well, the guard is nearby, so I might as well bring the Keaton mask to him, right? Yeah. So let's now go to the graveyard for the other Skullchlas, and I hope that it's dark right now, so we can actually get the Skullchlas. 
And there's also another heart piece we can get in here. But I actually want to get some money first before I do it. I want to get as much money as possible. Because it's a kind of annoying uh, mini game if you don't use a certain trick. So let's see. Where is that skull slime? There it is. Nice. Okay, let's get that skull slime. Get out of here. Okay, let's get the boomerang. Oh, sold out. Yeah, that's a, that's awesome. I got a sold out sign. Cool, man. Okay, let's get the skull slime. Target, please. Thank you. Okay, so I'm actually going to spoil it a little bit. Oh, wait a second. I don't even have to spoil it because I have... 38 skulls I can actually get another reward so oh my god that's really nice we're having so we're already have so much skull so many skulls sorry we are we're almost at a halfway point so that's awesome so let's get our reward first before we go to the next skull that's near uh, let me see I think it's near Gerudo Valley in Gerudo Valley are two skulls we can get and right before Gerudo Valley is one skull slot we can get. So I think we can actually get two rewards. So that's really awesome. So let's first claim our third reward. And I already know what it is because you I I need it for the mini game I was talking about earlier. And let's see. Okay, I saved you, I guess. The curse has been broken! Thank you! Here's a reward for you! Da 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 da! You got a giant's wallet! What a huge wallet! Now you can carry up to 500 rupees. And that's um, why I personally wanted to do the minigame later. Because if you have 500 rupees, you have quite a big chance to get the heart piece. And you will see later what I'm talking about. Also, there's also a secret hole in the middle of this village. So somewhere around here. I don't know where it is because I don't have the rumble pack. But um, yeah, let's try out some throws and maybe we get lucky. Because there's actually a a secret hole. Oh, well, oh my god, I got it straight away. Because this one is really useful. Because you can get a lot of money if you go inside here. And we really need money, so that's really useful. Um, I think it's better to just use the Sun Sun to stun them. It's always the better option. And you will see what the reward will be. And it's a very, very great reward this early in the game. If you get the reward later, it will, won't be much use. But uh, at this point in the game, it's a lot of money. So let's hope that we don't get raped by the Redads. And that's nice. Let's get this one. Oh my god. Don't get raped, Link. Get, don't get... Thank you. Okay, that was amazing. So let's see what's inside the chest. Da -da 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 no, it's a small chest. He just kicks it open. Like a boss. Oh my god, you got a huge rupee! This rupee is worth a whopping 200 rupees! Yeah, you heard that right, 200 rupees. So, that's a really nice place to find rupees. Okay, so I think we have time for one more little Skulltula. And I'm actually going to show you guys that in a bit. I'll see you guys at the entrance of Gerudo Valley. So I'll see you guys there. My god, I'm so stupid. I actually forgot to plant a magic bean in here. So let's do that first before we go to Gerudo Valley. Man, I'm so stupid. Okay, we still have four more, so that's nice. So let's put that one there. Awesome. So now we're done here. So I'll see you guys at Gerudo Valley. Okay, welcome back guys. We're finally near the entrance of Gerudo Valley. And there's actually another sculpture we can get near here before we actually go to Gerudo Valley. As you can see, there's a ring of stones right there. And there's actually a secret hole in the middle. So let's blow it up, shall we? Now let's claim another sculpture. Awesome. Oh, thanks. Thanks. Actually give me some uh, hearts. That's awesome. So let's see where that Skulltula is. Hmm. As you can see, everything is covered in um, spider webs. So the thing to do is just use your Dins Fire and get rid of all those. Um, you see, I already used Dins Fire one. Um, I already used Dins Fire more than Ferrars Wind, and I will be using it m much more over the course of the game. So yeah, I really prefer D Dins Fire to Ferrars Wind. I really never used the uh, Ferrars Wind all that much. Hmm, where's that Skulltula? I think it was there. I'm not sure though. Let's see. Um, no. Well, it is in here. I'm, all, I'm 
pretty sure about that. Um, oh, I hear it. There it is. So let's kick that Skulltula's ass. Well, we, we're not really able to do that, but um, let's uh, hit him with a boomerang and capture him. And no, Link, don't do that. There it is. Targets. Hits. And let's get that Skulltula. Okay. Nice. Do -do 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 -do. Awesome. So, that's all we can do for now, I guess. So, I hope you enjoyed it, even though the... Um, uh, it was kind of boring to watch all the Skulltulas. I still hope you enjoyed it. And uh, next episode, we're going inside Gerudo Valley for the remaining Skulltulas in Gerudo Valley and the other Skulltulas. So, um, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye!